Hey, what's happening everybody? Jay Shock Blast here, playing a little Fallout 4, and this is exciting for me. Um, so here we are in Boston, in the Fenway section, and, you know, it doesn't look entirely like it does now. Obviously, this is like 300 years in the future, but, um, man, like, this part feels legit. Like, right here in Boston is a legitimate gas station that I've parked at before to go to Red Sox games. And uh, we are about to go to Fenway Park for the first time, now called Diamond City. And uh, this is a street that you know you would go down. And um, you know, right here, here we are, Fenway Park, AKA Diamond City. Um, this street right here, this is a school. And that building right there is Jillian's. It's like a, it's like a, <laughs> I was not expecting that. Um, so Jillian's is like a pool hall. Um, this is not really a street, um, but you'd walk down, uh, I forget the name of the street, but you'd walk down the street and this is very different. Oh, do I have to kill this guy? Um, so this is where like there's a bunch of clubs like House of Blues and stuff like that. No, no, I don't want to. I don't want to shoot you. You're, we're good. Yeah. So like, I've seen so many concerts on this street. Um, I mean, band. Like, I mean, I've seen Seven Dust like a few times. Um, Thursday, thrice, um, you know, I just, I can't even tell you how many bands I've seen on the street. Um, but here we are, we're in Diamond City. Um, this is kind of the back way. This is where the, the green monster is right here. I actually got to sit up there for the first time this year. Um, I don't know what's going on in there, but we'll, we'll check that out later. Um, and then you come over here. There should be a bridge that kind of goes down there, yeah. This kind of is where the Mass Pike is. So, you know, they did a, pre a pretty good job of kind of, uh, you know, putting Boston together and everything. Mass Ave is not right there. But, um, yeah, they did a very, very good job in the grand scheme of things. Um, failed. Help defend Overland Station. What? So, oh wait, it feels like this is the green monster. All right, they got this. All right, yeah, that was Mass Ave. Maybe I was at the wrong gas station, but, um, this is the, sh that would make this the street. I don't know. I'm a little confused though. Psycho Raider, where? Oh, really? leave them alone. I really just want to uh, experience Fenway Park in all its glory as we kind of walk around here. I know I could have walked in already, but uh, they're calling it Diamond City, which I totally understand. And here we go. No, leave him alone, dog meat. No, no, we don't want any part of that. Ah, <sighs> Diamond City. <laughs> Fresh coffee. There's a lot of stuff that's like exploding around here. Oh, please don't shoot me. We're, we're good guys. Oh, hi. I oh, can't talk to you. All right, and here we go. This is the entrance to Diamond City. See, so you got one of those fancy Volt suits. Those one size fits all. 
And here it is. What do you mean you can't open the gate? Fenway Park. This statue is not right here. Um, I think this is supposed to be like the main entrance. Um, but this is not... That's not like the... She mad. Right now, Danny Sullivan. I live here. You can't just lock me out. <sighs> Open this gate right now. You. You want into Diamond City, right? Uh, what? Who are you? Shh. Play along. What? What's that? You said you're a trader up from Quincy? You have enough supplies to keep the general store stocked for a whole month? <laughs> you hear that, Danny? You gonna open the gate and let us in, or are you gonna be the one talking to crazy Myrna about losing out on all the supply? Jeez, all right. I need to make it personal, Piper. Give me a minute. Better head inside quick before old Danny catches on to the bluff. Oh man. This place, Diamond City. What is it? Oh, the green jewel? She's a sight. Everyone who's anyone in the Commonwealth is from here, settled here, <laughs> got kicked out of here. A big wall, some power, working plumbing, schools, and some security goons are what make Diamond City the big monster it is. <laughs> the big monster. Oh, love it or hate it. You'll see for yourself soon enough. Let's go. Piper, who let you back inside? I told Sullivan to keep that gate shut. You devious, rabble-rousing slanderer. The level of dishonesty in that paper of yours. I'll have that printer scrapped Ooh, for that parts. that statement, Mr. McDonough? Tyrant Mayor shuts down the press. Why don't we ask the newcomer? You support the news? Because the mayor's threatened to throw free speech in the dumpster. What newspaper are you talking about? Mine. Public occurrences. And we're the hard look at the truth. So are you with us or not? Always believed in freedom of the press. Oh, I didn't mean to bring you into this argument, good sir. No. No, no. You look like Diamond City material. Welcome to the great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Safe, happy, a fine place to come. Spend your money, settle down. Don't let this muckraker here tell you otherwise, all right? <laughs> muckraker. This hasn't been the friendliest welcome. He's got you there, McDonough. Guess not everyone gets won over by that shark smile of yours. <laughs> now, was there anything particular you came to our city for? Just looking for something. Oh, uh, what is it you're looking for? Who would I talk to about finding a missing person? Well, whatever you do, don't bother going to Diamond City Security for help. Uh, don't listen to her. Well... I'm afraid that our security team can't follow every case that comes through. I'm confident that you can find help here. Diamond City has every conceivable service known to man. One of our great citizens can surely find the time to help you. Well, sure. And a mayor of a great city must know everyone. Who can help me? Oh, I'm sorry. I don't have time for any more questions. I'm a busy man. Enjoy oh, your stay in our fair city. <sighs> This is ridiculous. I want the truth, McDonough. What's the real reason security always shrivels away when talk of missing persons comes I've had up? enough of this, Piper. From now on, consider you and that little sister of yours on notice. Yeah, keep talking, McDonough. That's all you're good for. Hmm, <laughs> a big Diamond City welcome from the mayor. You feel honored yet? Look, I gotta go get settled in, but, um... 
Stop by my office later. I have an idea for an article you'd be perfect for. Ah, uh, we're definitely banging Piper. All right, we're not gonna. Ooh, Danny Sullivan. You're Sullivan, right? So, you're that traitor Piper was talking about. Something tells me she's pulled the wool over my eyes again. Am I right? I didn't mean to lie, officer. It all just happened so fast. <sighs> you're not the first guy Piper pulled into a heap of trouble he wasn't ready for. Thanks for being honest. If it were up to me, we would have just let the both of you in. But the mayor's calling the shots, and... Well, you saw how mad he is. Hey, what's brought you into town anyway? Be good to note it down in the logs. Just looking for something. Aren't we all? Now, was there anything particular you were looking for? Who would I talk to about finding a missing person? Oh, look, I'm sorry, but we're under orders not to get involved in missing person cases. There's a lot of institute paranoia right now. And we can't really risk fanning those flames with official action. What if people panic? I just need a little information, Danny. We can keep this off the record. I'm sorry, but I can't. I got orders. All right. I'll ask somewhere else then. Chin up. Maybe someone in town can help you? Yeah, we'll come back. All right, so there's this thing about going to Fenway Park. If you've never been to Fenway Park, the first time you go to Fenway Park, you're in awe when you walk out and see the field for the first time. It's really like, especially if you're a baseball fan, like you really, it like kind of overwhelms you. It's one of the most historic athletic places in the world. It opened the day after the Titanic sank or the day of the Titanic sank. Yeah, like that was what was in the newspaper and like the Boston Globe the next day. Titanic sinks, Red Sox open Fenway Park. So it's like a hundred years old at this point and we're gonna go check out uh, Diamond City. This game is just so awesome, like living in this area and just kind of seeing all these places that you've been. I mean, I live about 30 miles to the west of the, the area. Oh man, what do they do to my field? Wow. This is, this is very cool. It's a lot to take in. Oh, look at that. 1903, 1912, 1915, 19... Wait, 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 wait. There's three missing guys. Like... 2004, you know, you've got your 1918 one right there. 2004, 2007, 2013. Hello. Hello. Let's get it right. We won those World Series. And you see, you notice how I knew to look right up there? Because I know that's where they go. I think it's awesome that they have those five. Right there is where Don Orsillo and Jerry Remy would sit. Uh, unfortunately, Don Rosillo is off to uh, San Diego, and if you're a Padres fan, uh, you're in for a treat. Three papers, newcomers. If the Institute grabs you in the night, at least be warned. Diamond City Market. Huh. 
the best part is I can now fast travel to here. In a real vault suit? Dug out in. I once had seats basically like six rows back right here. This is the, the Red Sox dugout. Best seats I've ever had. There's Pesky's pole. Wow, they even got the numbers right. Wow. American League, National League, awesome. Now update, explore the combat zone. All right, uh, one I think is uh, Bobby Bobby Door. I don't remember. What? What? Where's number nine? No Ted Williams. Six is Johnny Pesky. Four is Bobby Door. I don't remember what one is. Eleven. There's no eleven. Eleven's not retired. Neither is thirteen. Twenty-one is Roger Clemens. Thirty-three is Jason Veritek, but I don't think that's retired. So you know, the new Coca-Cola sign is actually a Coca-Cola sign. Twenty-one, Roger Clemens. Uh, Jim Rice is number fourteen. That's retired. They got him close. Uh, this is where the bullpen is. Uh, it's not brick. Um, and then you have the green monster over here. What plants are these? Mutt fruit plant. Investigate the Museum of Witchcraft. Is that the real mayor? And here we have the green monster. And I sat right there, like uh, second row. Best seats I ever had. National League, American League, Boston, all hand operated. There's a door like right over here that Manny Ramirez used to go in and pee. Everybody, everybody, I need everyone's attention. I would like to address the subject that is on everyone's mind. And that is Keep the disgusting like that. article start thinking yours. has written. Diamond City has stood united for over 150 years. And what keeps us united are two things. First is the great green guardian behind me. The wall, our protector and our savior from the filth of the outside. And second is our faith and trust in each other. The faith and trust that has given us prosperity, security, and education for every citizen. And while the paper might point their fingers at sins and other ghost stories to drive us apart, we will not betray this sacred trust. Now, I want everyone to hear these next words very carefully. I am not a synth. I am the same flesh and blood boy who grew up on these streets, who was born in a shack just down the waterfront to Martha and Patrick McDonough. And I will not abandon my city due to the heinous allegations of the press. God bless this city. God bless the wall. All right, so that is my tour of Fenway Park, and uh, that right there is the Prudential Center, I believe. Should be, anyway. Uh, man, this is trippy. This is honestly like the part of the game. I was looking forward to the most uh, was was seeing Fenway Park. Ever since they uh, they showed off the, um, you know that, that this is gonna be a part of the game. Like this is what I've been looking forward to the most, Fenway Park. And uh, you know it lived up to the hype. It's uh, it's pretty cool, man. Dug out in. All right, I kind of want to go to the dugout. In. I'm intrigued. I've never uh, 
been in the Red Sox locker room myself. Although a kid I went to high school with is Wally the Green Monster, their uh, their mascot. This is so cool. This is awesome. Just unbelievable. Can I sleep here? No. Yeah. This is awesome. Never mind. I'll handle it myself. So that's Fenway Park, guys. I hope you enjoyed, and uh, we'll catch you later. See ya.